Using the cone shaped bit, very lightly go over the calloused areas of the feet until the skin is smooth. Be careful not to apply too much pressure and cause heat or discomfort. To remove cracks, insert the tip of the cone and move down the length of the crack. Repeat this process until the crack is removed. To remove pterygium, use a silicone bit with the machine on low speed. The long sapphire bit can be used to remove excess cuticle. and to smooth the top of the nails that are splitting or uneven. The long sapphire bit can also be used to remove dry or dead skin from down the sides of the toenails. To shorten and shape the toenails, hold the sapphire disc vertical, gently push straight toward the foot while moving the bit back and forth. When you reach the corners of the nails, slightly angle the wheel in order to remove the sharp edges that can be painful and lead to ingrown nails. If the nails are thick, you can angle the wheel the opposite direction and thin the nails to ease pressure from the client's shoes. callus that forms on the bottom of the toes. This is a result of pressure from narrow shoes over the years of wear and can be uncomfortable and unsightly. To remove this, use the cone bit. Use the silicone bit underneath the edge of the nail to remove filings that can remain after shortening the nails.